Okay, so here's how a turtle trap works. Let's come down here a little bit closer and have a look at it. This thing has a funnel on one end and it has bait, canned sardines inside the trap. And turtles swim into the funnel and then they get caught in this mesh and they can't figure out how to get out. And this one's already been pre-baited with sardines. So let's see what we got here. Oh, look. If you look in the back here, this is one we gotta be a little bit careful with handling. This is a snapping turtle. Not an alligator snapper, but a common snapper. And so let's get him out of the trap and see if we can have a better look at him. And you can, it's pretty obvious which is the business end. And so we're, we're gonna stay away. I mean, they get the name snapping turtle because they have the ability to bite really, really hard. So I'm gonna get him from behind right here. And he's gonna, <laughs> you wanna keep him away from your body. Okay, so here is a snapper. They also have pretty good claws, too. Let me see if I can get that rope off of him. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, can you hear him? You may be able to hear him hissing, but they make kind of a loud hissing noise as well. And boy, look at that hooked beak. So this animal, if it bit you, could probably give you a couple stitches. So we're gonna stay way away from his mouth. But look at the tail. It has this great dinosaur looking tail. And that's why a lot of people want to call these alligator snappers because the tail, it's really kind of a misnomer because the alligator snapper, the true alligator snapper that lives in the Mississippi River drainages has a smooth tail. And the common snapper has that alligator looking tail. So you can see how people get confused. Snapping turtles have a lot of different ways to hurt you. I mean, obviously they're not out to hurt anybody, but if you pick one up or catch one in a trap, it's going to try and protect itself. It can scratch. It has spikes on the back of its shell. Even the tail's sharp, and of course, it has the ability to bite. But you know what? They're, they're fabulous animals. It's really neat having them around. They're prehistoric looking, but they're not out to hurt anybody. They're just making a living like any other animal.